Well, I guess this is something new. Let's get it! Good morning, weekenders. It is Saturday, and I'm not in Bakersfield, as you might have guessed by the intro. I'm actually in Lake Powell with Logan and Steven. I flew over here yesterday after work. Had a pretty bumpy flight on the way over, but uh, pretty fun overall, I guess. Enough lollygagging. Let's go have some fun. here I'm just gonna be dropping off on this rock in the middle of this canyon and I have no idea where they went. They went this way but they just have to they come around the turn I'll film it. If not I'll be stuck in this rock. Uh, yeah so I'm sitting on this rock the water's about really deep right there but I can swim back to this land um, or maybe even swim to that rock. So I'm gonna put a I'm gonna put a pole right here. Which way you think I should swim? Should I swim to the land or to the rock? Let me know and then, uh, I'll do what y'all say. So uh, the rock I was standing on is right there. You can barely see it. I went ahead and swam to the land even though I know y'all voted the rock. Uh, I just didn't know how to get up the rock. So I'm on the land here. Hopefully uh, someone comes to rescue me soon. If not, I'm uh, in the canyon across from Forgotten Canyon, Lake Powell. Please come help. Just got done jet skiing, had a super awesome time. We're all very hungry and thirsty because the only thing we had to eat this morning was some Pop Tarts at like 8 o'clock. It's now 4.50, and that's pretty much the only thing we've had to eat and nothing to drink all day. I'm gonna grab some food, and I'm also gonna get some reviews from Logan and Steven on uh, what they think the jet ski ride was like. Hey, Mr. Logan, uh, can you give us a quick 10 second review of the jet ski ride? All right, well, I'd say overall the jet ski ride is a great idea. First, I thought it was gonna be a little expensive, but it turned out to be a great day, and renting the three jet skis is definitely the way to do it. We saw some great, nice cliffs, and then we also um, get a lot of exploring on our feet that was off of the jet ski, but coming back was very rough, very beat up, and uh, really exhausting. Steven? Yeah, I'm a little crisp from the sun, but all in all, I'd do it again tomorrow if I could. 
So we also had two breakdowns on the jet skis. Logan's was probably a little bit worse than mine. We got some rocks up in the impellers and then uh, Logan's got stuck in there. We flipped the bike over and then got a bunch of water inside of it. And then when we finally got the rock out, then he took off and it just wouldn't go anywhere. So we had to struggle to drain the water out. It took a lot longer than you would think. Then I got a rock stuck in mine, but we didn't flip it over. I kind of went under and grabbed it out. Thought I had them all out, but I didn't. There was one like wedged in between two fins of the impeller and I couldn't go more than like five miles an hour. So luckily we ran up on some guys with some tools so we could take off the little guard and try and get the rock out, but the tools didn't work at all. So we just ran it how it was and then uh, it fell out by itself. So a whole lot of wasted time there working on it for nothing. But we did get them all running right at the end and overall 10 out of 10. Well, we were about to take the ferry across the lake to get to the other side where my airplane is stored at. And the ferry is canceled because the waves are too rough. So we're gonna drive all the way around. I think it's like a three hour drive or so. Uh, we'll be checking in with you during the drive. What's holding you down? I ain't like others Don't let them hold your ground I am in the summer sky I am hearing all the lies Don't turn your back on me I'm here for you I'll let your fire as a cold goes to fall You'll be my messenger And I'll break through And I'll break So we just got to the airport, it's right over there, but we decided we're going to take some quick showers before we get to the airport. This van does not have as nice of a setup as the Sullivan, it has this hose up on the roof. Stop, let it out of course! <laughs> sun is setting over the lake. It looks a lot cooler in person than it does on the camera. We're going to end today here and uh, pick up tomorrow morning pretty much in the same place. Good morning again guys. It is Sunday now. We ended up sleeping in the van right next to the Krusty Duster so that was uh, pretty cool. We left the engine running most of the night and then it got really cold in there so I turned it off. I don't know if Logan and Steven were happy or sad about it, but sad. I was happy. Logan said he was sad about it. I think Steven might have been happy because he had mentioned before that he was cold too. Yeah, I was happy. Steven was, said he was happy. Me and Steven are going to hop in the Krusty Duster and go on a little sunrise cruise. So we just got back to the ground, safe and sound. Steven, what did you think about the flight? That was cool. Maybe the coolest thing. I've never done it like pal. <laughs> so, uh, since I have to get going kind of soon, well, I'd like to get going kind of soon, Logan's gonna miss out on his flight, and uh, maybe when he moves to California, he'll fly. So I'm back in the plane now. Logan and Steven are about to head off in the van, and I'm about to fly on back to Shafter, so, Time to set sail.
So I made it back to Shafter. Had an awesome flight over here. It was pretty much smooth sailing the whole way. It was really cool flying right over the top of Las Vegas also. That's why I had uh, those clips of the other planes in there. They're a whole lot closer in person than they were on camera. And it was really cool. Overall, great experience, great fun. And I guess there's only one thing left to do over here and that's to unload all this stuff from the back of the plane and head on home. So before I get back home, the only thing I've had to eat today was that little apple pie that you might have seen. And I'm pretty hungry, so I'm gonna go to the Taco Bell. Though it's only like 12 o'clock, pretty crazy to think that I just left Lake Powell this morning and flew myself over here and I still have half a day left to do stuff. But unfortunately, I am pretty tired already from not sleeping too well last night. And also that flying stuff kind of wears you out. I'm pretty sure this video is also plenty long enough already. I'm not really doing anything interesting for the rest of the day besides cleaning up all this mess from around the pool house and making this video. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this weekend right here and I look forward to seeing you guys next weekend. Croissant! <laughs>